Sure. Regular voice like this, I can't hear anything. Okay. Uh, testing one two testing. I'm not. I'm not. I got nothing. Testing. Testing one two testing. Under Armour Association. Testing one two. Little louder. How's this? Test one. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Definitely do that.
are live. We are live. Yeah, you said good. good. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm so glad to have you. I appreciate it.
Right, we're good. We are live. Cartersville, Georgia. The Under Armour Association. Finals taking place here in Atlanta, Georgia, July 12th through July 15th. In our first showcase game, we'll have B. Mays Elite out of Knoxville, Tennessee area versus Texas Hard Work. Quick look at B. Mays Elite. Starting lineup, number three, Norrence Berry. Number zero, Joseph Anderson. Number 32, Akeem Adusupe. Number 12, Andrew Williams. For Texas Hard Work. Number 13, Kevin Adams. Number 23, Journey Phillips. Number four, Langston Love. Number three, Brandon Seals. And we are ready to tip things off here. We jump that. Okay. And we are off. Ball control in the front court for B. Mays. Number 11 to the hoop. That shot is off. Rebound by Michael Jefferson for Texas hard work. Running at the point guard, Brandon Seals over in the corner. To number four, Langston Love. Seals has it again by the three-point line. Down inside. Back to Seals. Hesitation, corner shot, good inside passing. And the bucket is good. Oh, we have a shot clock violation, however. There is a 30-second shot clock in use. So B. Mays Elite will bring it up. We have no score as we start out early here. The foul call, number three. Brandon Seals for Texas Hard Work. Be a side out of bounds. Brandon Seals will take it out. To the big man, Akeem. Pick and roll to the basket. There's an outside shot. And we have a foul away from the ball. I believe that foul call was on number three, Brandon Seals. Be another side out for B. Mays Elite. B. Mays Elite out of the Knoxville, Tennessee area. These are 15 year olds. Freshmen, sophomores. Inside to the big man, there's a steal. Fast break opportunity. Off shot. Big Akeem gets the rebound. Texas back to defend, and the shot is off again. Texas hard work will bring it up in the front court. Working it around. Brandon Seals, two to three, it's off. Offensive rebound, and we have our first two points of the game by number four, Langston Love, Texas Hard Work. B. Mays brings it up into the front court now. Looking inside to Big Akeem, he has it, he's triple team, gets it out. We're gonna set it right back up. Shot is up. Rebound, Texas, quickly into the front court now. Number three, Brandon Seals takes it to the drive. It's blocked by Big Akeem. Here comes B. Elite on the break. The three-point attempt is good. Joseph Anderson. A little bit of a press, full court press coming up here from B. Mays Elite, they break the press. Texas goes into the front court. Pass back 
Seals once again at the point guard. Gets it down inside. And that shot was off. Thought he might have been fouled, but no call from the officials. They're letting him play. B. Mays now in the front court with 3-2 lead. Working it around. The big fella inside, Akeem. Oh, and there's a foul call. And that's going to send Akeem to the line. That will send him to the line. Akeem is 6'9". Big guy inside. Nice free throw stroke. Gives B, B. Mays a two-point lead early on here in the first quarter. 5.05 to go. Misses the second one. And Texas will bring it up. Number three once again. Brandon Seals running the point, running the show against this zone. That B. Mays is throwing at these guys. They are working it inside to the zone. That's what you want to do right there. Nice bucket. Nice bucket by Journey Phillips. And we have ourselves a tie ball game. 436, first quarter. 15-year-olds out here. Under Armour Association Atlanta Finals. There's a missed shot. Seals back into the front court. That shot's going to be off. Nice rebound. Nice rebound. And Texas goes up by two. Shot up. Foul's going to be called on Big Akeem over the back. And they're going to bring it up full court. Let's see if they're still going to keep the pressure on. Yes, they are. B. Mazely. They've been full court pressing from the beginning. And give the guys from Texas a lot of credit. They haven't had much trouble breaking the press. And we have a call right there. That time the press got to them. It's going to be a turnover. We have our first substitution of the game for B. Mays. Darlington Dunbar reports in now. As B. Mays goes to the hoop. A nice drive. Shot comes up a little short. Journey Phillips on the break. It's a one on two. He goes hard to the hole. Bucket. Nice shot. Journey Phillips. Eight to four. Guys from Texas have a four-point lead, 322 in the first quarter. Both teams playing pretty, putting on pretty good defensive pressure thus far. Back into the big guy. That's where the offense kind of starts. Three-point bucket is good. Joseph Anderson, his second one of the game. We've got an 8-7 ball game. Three-point attempt is off. And we have a foul. Looks like away from the ball. It's a foul call. I believe that foul was on number 13, Kevin Adams. Have another substitution in now for Texas. B. Mays brings it up. He's already made two three-pointers. This shot, however, is off. And a questionable call by the officials. I don't know if either one had a good view, but B. Mays gets the break, and they will take it out of bounds. Eight to seven right now. Texas hard work up. 239 left in the first quarter. Nice inside pass. And an easy ba basket that time for Tariq Dalton. As Mays Elite takes a two-point lead. Once again to the hole. Journey Phillips, his shot is off. The rebound and a foul call. 
foul call. Kevin Adams doing big work down inside. He gets the follow-up along with the foul. Three-point opportunity for Texas hard work. Free throws up, it's no good. B Elite brings it up into the front court. Joseph Anderson running the point guard. He's two for two from three point land. I'm sure they're gonna try to work it down into the big fella and run their offense from there. Spacing not so good, but they'll dump it in now. No Anderson shoots. This time he's off. Running a fast break is Texas hard work. A strong drive to the basket. That shot is off. Journey Phillips is there for the rebound. Working into the fourth court. Journey Phillips passes over. Good passing, good move, ball movement by Texas Elite. They're working inside to their Journey Phillips, but this time he traveled. This time he traveled. So they'll take it out. B Mays Elite out of Knoxville. They're up one right now. Joseph Anderson running the point guard. They've been throwing it into the big fella and running their offense from there. Two-man game this time, and that's stolen by the point guard for Texas hard work. Into the corner. Shot is up, no good. Big fella gets the rebound. Joseph Anderson up in the front court. B Mays the lead on the drive. Oh, and a nice block that time. Nice block. The block was number 13, Kevin Adams. He's been playing big on both ends of the floor. We have a substitution now for B. Mays. Akeem will check out. Get a breather. And number 20, John Hardy. Checks into the game. Inside, nice pass off of that out-of-bounds play. But the shot is missed. Journey Phillips on the break. Nice pass, but the shot is missed, however. B. Mays has it out. Bringing up. Journey Phillips harassing the B. Mays guard in the front court. And they'll set it up now. Number three is Norrence Berry, down inside. He takes it, drives, and a foul is called. That'll send Tyreek Dalton to the line with two shots. Twenty six point five seconds left to go here in the first quarter. We've got a one point ball game. First free throw is missed by Tariq Dalton. He'll have one more. Substitution in the game. Larry Dixon checks in. Joseph Anderson gets his first rest of the game. He misses them both, and Journey Phillips skies for the rebound. They'll bring it up into the front court. Braylon Seals, been running the point. They work the ball around. Texas hard work, working it around. 10 seconds left to go in the quarter. Pass it to the corner, the shot is up, and it is no good. At the buzzer, oh, good work, good work. Langston Love at the buzzer, really crashing the offensive boards. And Texas hard work goes up by three. At the end of the first quarter, it's Texas hard work 12, B Mays Elite 9.
we are ready to begin second quarter play live from Atlanta, Georgia. We're out in Cartersville for the UAA Finals going on all this weekend featuring some of the best young talent from around the country. Let's begin the second quarter here with Texas hard work inbounding. Inbound pass goes to Anthony Scott. Over to Braylon Seals. Inside, nice pass. And the pass goes in. A nice bucket that time by Michael Jefferson. Their bigs have been active during this first quarter and a little bit further. They have really been doing a great job working inside. B Elite now brings it into the fourth quarter. The big fella. Oh, and they call a jump ball. A jump ball. Strong move by John Hardy. But he got held up, got tied up. Johnny Phillips is taking a breather now for Texas hard work. And Kevin Adams returns. Kevin Adams and Michael Jefferson have really been active here in the first quarter for Texas hard work. And they've made the difference so far. It's Texas hard work is up by five points with 7.30 in the second quarter. Once again, the inbounds pass. Oh, and a travel call. Traveling call that time on B. Mays. Texas hard work will bring it up again. B. Mays is back into that full court pressure. We got a quick, have a whistle. Time out here on the court, another substitution in the game. Number four, Langston Love is in for Texas hard work. Braylon Seals out there. He get, takes it. Gets over the timeline. Into the front court and a steal by Joseph Anderson. Up quickly now is the elite. Fake shot. And they set it up. Into the, oh, got a push in the back, but the ref didn't see it. It's going the other way. Texas hard work now, bringing up into the front court. They, they've done a pretty good job of handling the press from B. Mays. I think only one turnover in the first quarter. But B. Mays, this is their style. They're gonna continue to pressure the ball. Texas hard work, we'll bring it in. Braylon Sims, he's doing an excellent job. At the point guard. Oh, and a nice quick basket. Oh, once again, Kevin Adams doing work. Texas hard work. Those two big fellas are really doing work down there. B. Mays has inserted Vicka King back in the game, maybe to take away some of that advantage Texas has had inside. And we got a foul on the floor. Texas hard work wanted a travel call right there. But instead, we're going to get a foul on the floor. It's great defense by Anthony Scott. But we get a foul call. Okay, number 12 is checked out of the game for, appeared to be hobbling a little bit for B. Mays. That was Andrew Williams. And John Hardy has checked back in. Hardy wants it inside. Oh, good defense once again. Texas hard work is really, really playing tremendous defense out here right now. The defensive pressure is getting to be made a little bit. That was Braylon Seals once again, taking it to the hole strong. He's going to get two shots. His team is up by seven right now with 6.15 left to go in the second quarter. The first free throw is good. So far, the offensive rebounding of Texas hard work has been the difference. And the second free throw falls. 
B. Mays Elite will bring it up into the front court. They're down by nine now. We'll pick and roll action there. And once again, another great steal. Texas hard work. Oh, and we got a foul call on that one. And the young man, he seems to be all right. That was number five, Anthony Scott. And he is a, one of the smaller guys on the floor, but he has really been playing a feisty defense. Very feisty defense. This Texas hard work team is, is putting tremendous defensive pressure on B-Rays right now. Has them a little bit frustrated, I believe. Scott appears to be a little bit hobbled. That was a hard fall he took at the end of that last play. But he'll get back to the line and see if he can sink the second one. His team is up by nine points with six minutes to go in the second quarter. And they go up by 10 now. Job, checks out the game and Journey Phillips checks back in. B. Mays will bring it up. They're down by 10 now. Joseph Anderson running the point guard. He's two or three from three point range. Going to their offense, number 11, Jaden Springer. He's double teamed there. Once again, tremendous defense. Oh, and they come back up with it from three. Oh, and the shot is off. Shot is off. That was Kevin Adams who took that three. Joseph, he misses this time. Nice offensive rebound. Can't get the shot to fall. Ah, oh, no foul call there for Norris Berry. And there's Seals. Oh, a nice crossover. Braylon Seals with the bucket. And Texas hard work is up by 12. And there's a timeout on the floor. There's a timeout on the floor. Texas hard work is up 12 now on B Mays Elite. 509, second quarter. Under Armour Association Finals. And so far, Texas hard work, uh, they're living up to their name because it's been their hard work and their pressure defense along with being very active on the offensive rebound. It's given them a 12 point lead with 5.09 left to go in the second quarter. I think B. Mays is going to have to hit a few outside shots to kind of loosen up this Texas hard work defense because they're slapping at everything. They're really working the boards, playing very hard right now. Number 12 checks into the game for Texas hard work. That's Chance Felix. B. Mays Elite brings it up into the front court. Number three with a nice drive, and he's fouled on the shot. Norris Berry, a nice driving free throw, uh, layup attempt. He was defended. He'll go to the line and shoot two. First free throw is good. Norris Bailey out of, Norris Berry, excuse me, out of Cleveland High School near the Knoxville area. And the second free throw is good. That cuts the deficit to 10 for B. Mays Elite. More substitutions in the game. Michael Jefferson sits down. Langston Love checks in. They work it out in the front court. Chance Felix over to Seals. Back to Felix. Good ball movement here from Texas hard work. 
They're going to have to get it in, though, because the shot clock will be running down. Seals takes a tough shot and hits it. He's having a nice game under control all the time. Good looking point guard for Texas hard work. Joseph Anderson now inside. They are triple teaming the big time. He's going to have to get tough and take it anyway, and he does, and he gets the basket. And a three point opportunity. Big Akeem put in work that time. I think he's going to have to do more of that. He's going to have to kind of put this team on his shoulders and open things up for the rest of his teammates. Akeem, 6'9", out of Knoxville Christian School. Fine looking prospect. Texas hard work brings it up. Seals over the chance. Back to Seals. And they work it down. Very good ball movement. Journey Phillips on the shot. He misses. Big Akeem gets the rebound. Here's a, here's a chance for B. Mays to cut into this lead now. Nice drive. Jaden Springer. They're going to call it a jump ball. And once again, that pressure defense that Texas hard work is putting in right now, uh, it, it's really causing problems for the B. Mays elite guards. They're having trouble getting into their offense. Texas hard work will bring it up. They've dropped the press now. In a zone. One, like a one, three, one zone. Texas hard work now taking their time. Great ball movement. They do a good job of getting the shot they want. But this time, B. Mays hangs in there, gets a steal. They're going to be bringing it up, trying to cut into this 10-point lead. Norris Berry now working it over to Anderson. Inside to Akeem. They're going to, again, they come with a double team, but he goes strong anyway. He's going to have to continue to do that. I know it's tough, but he's got to continue to just force, get that ball up to open things up for the rest of his teammates. He's back at the free throw line again, and maybe he can <coughs> allow some of this Texas uh, hard work front line to get into some foul trouble in trying to defend him. I came at the line shooting two free throws. Gets the first one to drop. Cuts the lead down to nine. 251 left to go in the second quarter. And the second is good. Cut it down to eight now. It's Texas hard work brings it up. Anthony Scott now with the ball. Driving, nice pass inside. Passes up the shot. They're waiting. They're going to find the shot they want. But very patient in their offense. Ball over to Langston Love, who's going to drive all the way over the big fella. But good defense that time by B. Mays Elite. And now they can cut this lead down to six points, which is close as they've been in a minute. We've got a foul before he gets up. Texas hard work, and that's going to be their, I believe their fourth team foul. Now it's going to be their fifth team foul. They are in the bonus. We are at the one and one. Jaden Springer will be at the line. One in the bonus. First shot's up. Missed it. Texas hard work gets the rebound. Up quickly. Nice drive. Couldn't get it to fall. Ball is out of bounds. And it's going to go to B. Mays Elite. Two oh five left in the second quarter. B Mays elite down eight. They've been down as many as ten. Looks like Texas hard work is going to go to some some kind of trap. 
Females up quickly. Oh, and they call a blocking foul. May have bailed the Texas Elite player out, but it's the call the ref made. So they're going to go to the line in the one and one. Darlington Dunbar at the line, shooting one in the bonus. Misses the free throw. Texas hard work will bring it up. They are up eight with 155 left to go in the first half. And we have a timeout on the floor. So we have a timeout with 153 left. Texas hard work 23. B May's elite 15. But I see the storyboard. Some of the storyboard comes when you have storyboard that's do it during timeout. Okay, we are back. 153 left in the first half. Texas hard work is up by eight right now, and they've done it with defense. They've done it with offensive rebounding. They have been very active. As they bring, get set to bring it in. Gonna work it around. A good pass. Journey Phillips on the drive, misses the shot. And once again, Texas hard work with the rebound. No foul call. That shot was intimidated by the big fella. They're working around. Shot clock running down. Texas elite working it. Journey Phillips puts up the shot, he misses. Gets his rebound, back up again. And finally, the offensive rebound goes through Kevin Adams. Once again, more offensive rebounding work for these guys from Texas. And once again, defensive pressure causes another turnover. They are having a hard time dealing with Texas and their hardworking, active defense. Hands are everywhere. Texas works it in. Number 12, Chance Felix. Oh, and a nice pass inside. The shot is missed, however. Akeem gets the rebound. Tyreek Boyd will bring it up for B. Mays Elite. They want to work it in to the big guy. Here comes that double team, but he goes. A I think that time he got a little bit excited with the puppies. It's going to be a turnover. 10 point game, 34 seconds left in the first half. Texas hard work. May want to run this down to pretty close to the last shot. Journey Phillips. Breaks it out, nice pass. Pull up jumper, no good. They are just working. Texas is really, really working hard. And that's the difference in the game right now. Got 8.6 seconds left. Texas is going to inbounds the ball. Got to hurry up and get it in. They get it in. Double team in the corner. Nice trap that time by B. Mays. And that's going to come in the other direction. B. Mays will get the final shot of the half. That time, great defense by B. Mays, elite. Five seconds left. See if they can get a shot off. Tyreek Boyd bringing up court quickly. He shoots from three. Ooh, and it's in and out. And it's halftime. Texas hard work up by 10.
we are ready to begin the second half. It's the UAA Under Armour Association Finals going on all this weekend, July 12th through 15th, here in Atlanta, Georgia. We're in Cartersville now, watching Texas hard work against B. Mays Elite out of Knoxville. Texas hard work right now is up by 10, and they've done it with defense, and they've done it with offensive rebounding. Joseph Anderson brings the ball up right now. They're in a man-to-man -man now, Texas hard work. Let's see if B. Mays Elite can perhaps do something against, have a little better success against this man-to-man -man than they did the zone. That shot was hit by number 11, Jaden Springer, and that cuts the lead to eight points. This Texas hard work team, oh, and a nice drive by Journey Phillips. 6-3, swooping layup. Brings Texas hard work back to a 10-point lead. B. Mays bringing in the front court now. Nice pick set, straight to the hole, and a nice strong drive that time by B. Mays, Norris Berry. So they've come out with a little bit more fire in the second half. I think that man-to-man -man defense may help B. Mays lead out because they didn't have an answer for the zone in the first half. So let's see how they can go against this man-to-man -man pressure. Once again, Texas hard work, bringing it up into the front court. Nice passing inside. Texas hard work. Kevin Adams, he's having a, a monster game. Very well coached team. Drive, the big fella takes it inside. Didn't get it, but once again, Jaden gets the offensive rebound. He's come out with a little more fire in the second half. Jaden Springer, Rocky River High School. Texas brings it back to the front court. Nice move to the basket. Three-pointer is open. Oh, Miss Badley. Michael Jefferson. So, B. Mays Elite has a chance to cut the lead back down to six. Joseph Anderson will bring the ball up. And I see that Texas has gone back into that zone. Jaden Springer, he's really playing hard this second half. Didn't get the call that time, but he's really, really playing a, 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 a really come out in the second half and is, is really taking his effort up, trying to keep his team in the game. Texas hard work will bring it up. They are very patient on offense against this zone that B. Mays is running at them. Inside, the big fella, ooh, couldn't hold on to that one that time. Michael Jefferson and there'll be a turnover. B. Mays Elite will get it. Joseph Anderson brings it up. the guys out of Tennessee. 15 year olds out here going at it. Oh, pushing the back and the ref did not miss the call that time. And this time they're getting, they're pushing the back. I believe that's the first team foul on Texas hard work. So out of bounds. Watch this Jaden Springer. He has really stepped up his game in the second half. Another shot, and it's good. That cuts the lead to six. And a timeout for Texas hard work as their lead has been cut to six. B. Mays elite, 5.08 in the second quarter. Third quarter, excuse me. We are back. 
508, third quarter. B. Mays has cut the lead to six. Second half, they have got a great effort from Jaden Springer. Cut the lead down to six. Texas hard work brings it up. Mr. Seal shoots. This time he misses. Once again, it's that guy, Jaden Springer. Oh, but that pass is taken away by Texas. They bring it up, a turnover. Quickly in the first court, they may have missed the carry, but continues to work. That's the guy from three. Ooh, shot is off. Once again, more work on the offensive glass from B. Mays. They are putting up a much better effort. That was Lawrence Berry. They are playing a little harder here in the second half, and it shows they've cut the lead to four. Texas, there's no panic in this team, though. Push off there that time call. As Texas continues just to work their offense. The lead has been cut to four. I think you're just seeing more effort in the second half out of B. Mays Elite. There's a three-point attempt. Air ball. Joseph Anderson brings it up in the front court. Straight drive to the basket. Shot is missed. A foul called on Texas that time. As John Hardy continued to work, got himself in position, gets the foul call. It's the second foul of the quarter on Texas. Be another sideline out. Four oh four left in the second quarter. I got a little stoppage in play here. A little discussion with the ref. Teaching moment going on. And B. Mays will inbound it. They can cut this lead down to two. And Jaden Springer, he's really been going hard. He's got his man in the corner for three. And there's a whistle away from the ball. Another foul called away from the ball. That's the third team foul for Texas. Hard work. 4 on one in the third quarter. Looking to inbound. Springer shoots again. And he hits again. This time from three. It's a one-point game. Jaden Springer has been a man possessed here in the third quarter. He has single-handedly got his team back in the game. It's a one-point ball game. Texas now not as much movement offensively, but they're still being very patient. The worker ball around inside. Shot goes up. It is no good. And here comes B. Mays Elite. Back on the break. Joseph Anderson, he waits, kicks it back out, the big fella. Gets it in to Akeem. Travel call. Good defense that time from Texas. As Chance, Phillip, Chance Felix, excuse me, stepped in and did the job right there. Caused the big fella to shuffle his feet with tremendous pressure defense. They are sending double and triple teams at him every time he touches the ball. Texas hard work now brings it up court. Their lead has been cut to one. They've been struggling to get into their offense the second half, and there's another turnover. Anderson all alone on the break. B. Mays has taken a one-point lead. They were down by as many as 10. They have come back to take a one-point lead with 2.42 left to go in the third quarter. Right now, Texas hard work has got to find some offense. Seals goes hard to the hole. They're going to call a jump ball. And the possession arrow goes to B. Mays. Right now, Texas have hard work having a hard time getting into their offense. And it's been an increased effort by B. Mays. They've just done a great job with just more effort here in the second half. They've actually gone up by one point. Texas hard work. I don't know if they scored in the third quarter, but they're having a hard time getting the ball in the hole. Even really getting shots off. So let's see what happens. 233 left to go. Third quarter. 
Springer has been carrying the load for B. Mays. Nice pass. And another bucket. B. Mays once again. Mr. Springer off to Dun Dubar that time. Darlington Dubar. And B. Mays, the lead has gone up by three. Texas having a hard time getting the shot off. They may have to loosen these guys up from outside, but as soon as I say that, a tremendous pass inside, and it's going to be a goaltending. Michael Jefferson. So Texas hard work sticking to their game plan. They get an inside shot that time. Goaltending called. Cut their deficit to one point. B. Mays Elite will bring it in. Tariq Dalton is checked into the game. Springer goes back, step back, misses the shot. Here they go, fast break. Oh, miss layup. B. Mays Elite brings it back. And a turnover at the time. Once again, good pressure. From Texas hard work guard Anthony Scott. B Mays, Tyreek Boyd checks in for B Mays. Oh, left the ball there on the floor. They go to the floor to get it. Jump ball. I believe the ball goes to Texas this time. So give B. Mays Elite a lot of credit because they have really played a lot harder here in the second half. Texas hard work to bring it in. Once again, they're running their offense. They're pretty patient. Continuing to get good ball movement. There's a nice move. Shot is up. Shot clock, no good. Oh, nice pass inside. And those are the big fellas going to work again. I think they missed a the goaltending call right there. Unfortunately, they can't go to the re replay. But I think he got robbed on that call. Referees missed that one. It's still a one-point game. Oh. Ball almost stolen. B. Mays brings it in. Don't let him catch it, Bob. Bob, don't let him catch it. Tyreek Boyd running the show for B. Mays Elite. Spin. He was fouled. Going to be the fourth team foul. The third quarter, 45.2 seconds left. It's a one-point game. Good game. Both teams playing hard. As B. Mays Elite will bring in the ball. Jaden Springer run the point. Ah, lost at that time, but Tyreek Boyd is there. He takes a three. Let's go. One, Mr. Brown, we go. And we have a got a foul call. Got a foul call. And they will inbound the ball. Right in front of us here. Texas hard work bringing it in, running their offense as they continue to do this entire game. They haven't gotten out of their offense yet. That time a bad pass. B. Mays Elite will get an opportunity to go up, increase their lead. They are up by one point here with 17 seconds left to go in the third quarter. They bring it up.
We're ready to begin the fourth quarter. We have a one-point ball game. B. Mays Elite out of Knoxville, Tennessee. They're up by one point over Texas Hard Work. Texas Hard Work only scored two points that quarter. They had a tough time getting their shots off, but their defensive pressure in the first half still has them in the game. B. Mays Elite was down by as many as 10. They've come back to take a one-point lead. Jaden Springer has been outstanding in the, in the second half for B. Mays Elite. And they are up by one as they get the first crack out of here in the first quarter into their offense now. The shot goes up. It's no good. Akeem on the rebound. That shot won't go. Ball goes out of bounds. Texas ball. Texas Elite will bring it up to the up court, to the front court. Working the ball, working their offense. Journey Phillips over to Langston Love. They work the offense. Anthony Scott still running his journey. Now shot clock running down. Journey puts it up and in. Texas hard work up by one. We didn't hear from Journey in the third quarter, but he starts out the first fourth quarter with a bucket. Puts his team up by one. As B. Mays Elite looking for a good possession this time. Jay Springer, he's been carrying the team. That time, a little bit, a little bit of a bump. A little bit of a bump, a good call by the ref. Kevin Adams, he's been an impact player in this ball game. That time he picked up the foul. I lost it. What did I do? B. Mays Elite with it now. Joseph, he takes a shot. Three-pointer hasn't hit since the first. That one's off. Journey Phillips with the rebound. Bringing up the floor now. Anthony Scott over to Journey Phillips. Back to Scott as they continue to work the ball around. This time he splits the defense inside. Nowhere to go with it, but he gets it back out. And Texas hard work. They've got to get, got to get ready to get a good shot off here. They've been very patient. Let's see if Journey gets it. At the shot clock. Shot is missed. B. Mays Elite will bring it in. Will bring it up. They are down by one. 6-11 left to go in the fourth quarter. Inside the Akeem now. As he turns back out to Anderson. Nice pass over in the corner. Shot is missed by B. Mays. Norris Berry, but there's a foul called on the play. Got some more substitutions coming in the game now. As Darlington Dubar checks in for B. Mays Elite. They are down one. Close game. Springer on the drive. And may have gotten bailed out that time, but he got to the spot first. So he's going to get an opportunity to make two free throws. Put his team back up. Two shots coming up now. As he misses the first free throw. Second free throw is up. This time he makes it. And we've got ourselves a tie ball game. 5.45. Five left to go, fourth quarter. Texas Elite. Be made. Elite. Texas hard work.
going at it. Block, no foul call that time. Well, they actually do call a foul. I believe the foul goes on number four for B. Mazley. It's Larry Dixon. And that's going to send Journey Phillips to the line, shooting two shots in a tie ball game. It's the first one. I can say I can't. Set the line now, Journey. Second point. Chance for him to go into double figures. He's got nine points today. Gets his 10th point. He's now in double figures. As we have ourselves a two point ball game with 527 left. Joseph Anderson brings it up for B. Mays Elite. Fighting for position now. Keem has it. He gets the double team. Nice pass out of the double team, but a great block that time from the Texas hard working team. A three point attempt. And, a, and I believe that was a side out. And B. Mays Elite will bring it up. They are trailing by two with five, four minutes and 50 seconds to go here in the fourth quarter. Springer up again, shoots. They scrap for the rebound. And Texas hard work will get the call. Texas hard work takes over. 447 left in the fourth quarter. They are up by two right now. And they have, despite a furious comeback from B. Mays Elite, Journey Phillips has settled in in the fourth quarter and he's been able to give his team a two point lead. As Texas brings it up now, fourth quarter action. Seals fakes the shot. Pass over in the corner. They continue to work around. This time Seals does shoot it in a three-pointer. It's good. Nice shot from Braylon Seals. Puts his team up by five. B. Mays Elite now got to come up with something. 4-12 left. The big fella shoots a nice soft three. It will not go. And Texas Hardware. Hard work is on those boards. Nice pass once again. Phillips shoots. Shot is off. Oh, a nice block that time by Akeem. Those two big fellas are going at it down there inside. That time Akeem got the block. Texas is going to get the ball out of bounds as they go up by five in this ball game. They settled the ship. Played really well so far here in the third quarter. In the fourth quarter, excuse me. Ball out now, Texas hard work. Making their moves. Almost a turnover, but they get back. Back to Seals. Jefferson, nice pass inside Phillips. Oh, and the shot is off, but he scraps. Gets the rebound. Seal shoots another three. That time it's off. But once again, Texas getting the rebound, getting those offensive rebounds. That's been their bread and butter this game. Very patient in the offense. Phillips that time missed. And B. Mays Elite will get it. So they got some work to do. They're down five points with 316 left to go in the fourth quarter but they've shown an ability to come back because we're going to have a timeout on the floor. 316 left, Texas hard work up by five. left to go in the fourth quarter. 
Texas hard work up by five points. B. Mays has possession of the basketball with three, a little over three minutes left in the fourth quarter. They come back, they were down as many as 10. They're falling back down by five right now, but they're still fighting. We've still got time left. Inside, nice move inside. Couldn't get the shot to fall, John Hardy. Here comes Texas hard work now, trying to add to their five point lead, but there's a turnover. There's a turnover. One of the few Texas hard workers had this game. But they did turn it over there. It gives B. Mays another opportunity to cut into this lead. 250 left, fourth quarter. Team from Texas is up by five. Inside passes, they work around this time into the big fella. Oh, swiped that in as he came by. He's got to shoot it, and he hits it. His third three-pointer of the game. They needed that. Cuts the lead down to two. It's Texas hard work. Once again, very patient in their offense. Looking for the best shot that they can get. Journey Phillips and one. Nice ball work that time by Texas hard work. Journey Phillips will take it to the line. Another opportunity for finish off a three-point play. He has, uh, he's really made a difference here in the fourth quarter. Misses the free throw, however. And his team is only up four. B. May still hanging around with 2.11 left. There's the three-point shooter. It's up again. Ooh, this time it's off. And Texas gets the rebound. Michael Jefferson. As they work it out now, Texas. 150 left to go in the game. Braylon Seals, it's a steal this time. Anderson, ooh, and another steal this time. Back by Texas, hard work. B. Mays is picking up their defense. The pressure is pretty good. Shot clock goes up, air ball. And that time they rushed the shot a little bit, looking for the shot clock to expire. May, maybe they could have waited a little longer and, and got a little more under control, but it's hard to know those things in the pressure and the heat of the game. So B, B Mays Elite will take over. They're down four. It's a minute 26 left. Springer brings it up. Drives, takes it all the way, and a nice shot. He scores and gets one, and they got a chance to cut it to one. Springer has been a, a one-man game, really, in the second half for uh, B. Mays Lee. He's really taken the team on his shoulders. Played a tremendous second half. He's got a chance to cut this game, make it a one-point ball game. Going to have some substitutions now for Texas as they – Take out the big fella, bring in more ball handling. As they bring in Anthony Scott. They're going to want to get the ball up the court, protecting what is now still a two-point lead. Texas brings it up. The defense has really stepped up here in the last couple minutes as B. Mays Elite is trying to put the pressure on. We get a comeback victory, and there's a steal. Oh. May have got a bailed out by the refs that time. Looked like a good steal, but we got to go with the call. So Texas gets it. Very fortunate that time not to have that lead to a layup and tie this game up, but they're going to take it on the side out. They're working in, passing to the backcourt to Seals. Doesn't have a lot of time on the shot clock. They got to get it off, Journey Phillips up, and a block. That time, Springer, all he could do was foul. Good, good basketball right there. Two guys, things getting a little chippy inside. 
but you can expect that with 54 seconds left in a two-point ball game. Two good ball players there, Journey Phillips and Jaden Springer. We've got a technical foul, I believe. They've called a tech. Let me see, has the technical foul been called? Oh, no tech. He's warning. I think he called a double tech. Warned Journey Phillips as well as Springer to cut it with the, with the chatter. No free throws will be taken. Good decision by the ref. Let the players decide the game. Phillips is at the line with two free throws. It's the first one. He's had a strong fourth quarter in this basketball game. And they brought the big fella back in to go down on defense. Kevin Adams checks back in the game. Johnny Phillips at the line for the second free throw. He misses. Oh, but the offensive rebound. Offensive rebound by Langston Love, and that was huge. Foul call. Oh, we got a timeout. Got a timeout by Texas Hardware. Forty-five seconds left to play. Texas hard work is up by three. Both teams are in the one and one. We've had a tight game. B Mays Elite has come back. They were down by as many as ten. Got themselves back into this game before Texas hard work went back up. But we're still here in the fourth quarter, and they still got a chance, and they're still almost in the inbounds, but Texas comes up with it. Johnny Phillips to the hole. Nice defense that time by B. Mays Elite. They're going to bring it up. 34 seconds left. Oh, and we've got a foul call. We've got a foul call on Texas hard work as Norris Berry drove to the basket. He's got an opportunity to make this a one-point ball game. If he hits them both, 31 seconds left. in a game that has been tight throughout the second half. Both teams playing really hard, showing a lot of great effort. All these kids playing very, very hard. Really playing good basketball. First one's up, sinks it. Two point game now, Texas hard work up two. 31 seconds left. Opportunity to make it a one-point ball game. And he sinks the free throw. We have ourselves a one-point ball game with 31 seconds left. Inbound pass, stolen. Springer gets it. And the bucket's good. B. Major League goes up by two. That time... Texas having a hard time getting the ball in the front court. They've got the big fella bringing it up. Guards have left. Here come the guards now. Here, Journey Phillips. He's the guy that'll take the shot. And a nice block by Akeem. That time, Texas gets the ball. Good call by the, by the referee. We've got 12.8 seconds left. We are going down to the final seconds here in our first game. One-point ball game. Texas elite to Texas Hard work, 10 bounds. Let's see what happens here. 12 seconds left. We're going down. Oh, and they're going to send him to the free throw line. They're going to send him to the free throw line. Both teams are over the limit. 
It's going to be a one and one with 10.9 seconds left. Texas hard workers trailing by one. They got Journey Phillips. He's been a leading scorer in this ball game for Texas hard work. Two big free throws upcoming. And he misses. And the rebound is. The rebound goes to B. Mays Elite. Norrence Berry. 7.5 seconds left. He's got a chance to put his team up by three. Plenty of time still, though, for Texas hard work. They've got some good players. They're going to be able to get a good shot off here. It's up to Norris Berry now. Shooting two free throws. It's pretty big the last time he stepped up here. Misses. Got a shot here. Let's go down to a two-point ball game. And we are now have a two-point ball game. Six seconds left. They bring it up into the front court. Nice drive to the basket. Shot is blocked. Shot is blocked by B. Mays Elite. And with .7 seconds left, the big fella inside, he made the difference. Hasn't been there all there offensively for B. Mays Elite. Springer's handled most of the scoring, but the big fella has been definitely made a difference inside and another block for the bill he's got to have about five blocks in this ball game another big time block there it's going to give uh b mays elite looks like they're going to be able to ice this game away very entertaining game b mays elite hung around it looks like they're going to come out of here with a victory in this showcase game 15 year olds atlanta georgia UAA Finals. And B Mays Elite goes up four, and that's going to do it as the buzzer will sound. And B Mays Elite comes away with the victory out of Tennessee, 45, Texas Hard Work, 41. I'm going to find out. <laughs>